What's up, Fire Fan? My name's Car on Fire, and welcome back to a brand new video. Today, we are going over 2.8, another patch for Conan Exiles, not 3.0. God damn it. <laughs> but there is some still really cool changes in here, and I think you're going to really like a change in here today um, because I've been having a lot of fun with it already. In this new update for servers, they've added a new queuing system when joining a server. So if that server is full, you will now automatically be queued to join. So you'll be sat in a queue waiting to join if that server is a really busy server. So that is something you can do. And uh, if you are a server owner, you can turn that on and off. But more importantly, you can now assign emotes to followers. So your little friends can all play different emotes. It is awesome. You can do all sorts. And uh, wow, I had something particular in mind when this came up. I was like, hmm, there is one thing that comes to mind when you say about assigning emotes to followers. And to be honest, that is being as annoying as possible. So, um, yeah, I wanted to put together an orchestra. So, uh, yeah, now I can do that. That's great. I love it. <laughs> uh, this is my favourite now, favourite feature, and I hope you enjoy it too. <laughs> uh, of course, not many people are going to do this. Don't worry about it. Don't take it out of the game. <laughs> So yes, you can now be really annoying if you perhaps want to, um, it's an option. And there are some new emotes you can actually go and learn around the Exiled Land and Sifter. So you can go ahead and grab those and, uh, you know, have a great time. So have fun finding those. There's a few new ones I have found myself. Let me know if you find any as well because I am actively searching for them um, because I really, really, really want to see all the emotes. But I have found a few and I'll show you them. They've also done quite a few fixes. So they fixed some issues that cause feats to be missing after learning them under specific circumstances. So they fixed that. They fixed uh, some attacks on the mounted rhino that would not cause damage. And a rare issue where frauds would remain in the state where they could not go and attack. They've also made Mammoth now rotate in a less janky way. Rhino should no longer moonwalk out of combat. Shagai horror pets now have a projectile for their ranged attack. NPCs should no longer move when attacking. Woohoo! Praxis will now spawn where he's supposed to and at the rate he's supposed to. Frawls that have been knocked down should no longer forget their guarding location. Frawls should now be able to engage with giant enemies correctly. Now this one I think is a huge one, but they fixed an issue where the purge would spawn inside treehouse bases. So this was a huge problem that happened in the jungle that now is not going to happen, so thank the lord for that. The sandstorm should no longer kill players on the broken highway if they've crossed it, not crossed it yet, or if they load in the area while sandstorm is ongoing. You can't climb up storm glass gate frames anymore. And a really big one that I'm really excited for is the hair. Now, you'll probably know that hair has been a little bit weird looking for a while. Like some of the colors are not quite correct. Well, now in this update, you can see my hair, this blonde version of hair, used to come out red. You can actually still see a bit on my eyelashes, actually. Hey, hey, hey you haven't fixed it completely. <laughs> you can see my eyelashes are red for some weird reason as a blonde. It doesn't really make sense. 
and it looked really weird before but they have now fixed the hairstyle so they look luscious and nice again so there you go uh, you can go back to enjoying the blonde colours. I think those are the mostly affected ones. You can just enjoy the hair again and have some fun with that. So very, very nice. With this new patch as well, apparently when frogs get angry at you, they're going to do like angry emotes. So let's have a look if this actually works or not in this patch. This is like test live at the moment. So are you going to get angry at me? Oh, she didn't quite get angry at me. All right, let's see if we can find something else that gets angry at me. Oh, no. Well, he growled at me. Brr. Get mad at me. No, that's not angry enough. Angry. No, too angry. <laughs> let's try another camp. Let's see if they get angry at me. <laughs> All right, I got some new people to get angry. So let me see. Maybe if I hit them first, maybe they will get mad at me. No. <laughs> That's a no. Hang on, let me go hit someone else. Get mad at me! Come on, get mad at me. Oh, none of them are particularly mad at me. Man! I don't think it's working. I don't know. Let me see. Get mad at me. <laughs> get mad at me. Do it, I dare you. No. <laughs> get mad at me. Yes. Oh. Well now, uh, will you get mad at me though? Hiya! No, I really wanted them to do like a really angry emo at me or something. That's so sad. Okay, maybe, hopefully this is a thing in the future or maybe they meant something else. I don't know. Um, oh my goodness. Okay, time for me to bail! Huh, interesting. What is that even? Is that your head? Why do you have two heads? <laughs> Uh, okay, never mind. <laughs> but yeah, I love how they have emotes now. If you wanted to trigger the emotes yourself, uh, all you need to do is like hold your uh, wheel up and then you do behavior and then you go into emotes and then you go in where you can clear the emote or you can choose an emote. And at the moment, they have a few available that you can use. You can seduce, you can worship, you can uh, relax in multiple ways. Uh, different expressions also, uh, celebration, so if you have uh, Debauchery's of Decado DLC, all of those emotes seem to be included, you can make them dance as well, um, and you can make them do other things like sifting through, having conversations, um, all sorts, so it's, uh, it's really cool, I like it, so they just take a little bit and they should do the thing. So there we go. Having a conversation with Leon. <laughs> but I love it. It's really awesome. And uh, of course, definitely go and find those new emotes. Let me know what you think about this patch. I think it's it's pretty nice. We've been asking for emotes for frogs for a while now. So it's really wonderful to see them implemented into the game now. And all right, to get you started on these locations for the actual emote books, there's a new one here that you can find that will give you all the talking emotes. You can find that in Conan's Tavern over here on the map here. There's another book just by the tavern as well. It's up here hidden behind the sky. You can get a lot of emotes over there already. You see the set shrine? It's just hidden here, so you can grab it. And uh, that is right here. Another emote that works on the frills is this one, and it's Sift and this is by the obelisk by the entrance to the map room in the unnamed city so uh, check that one out it's right in the entrance where you can find it in the archives and then coming to the jungle going up these huge stairs by this kind of area you come into here and you can find another book right here and that will give you eat and you can nom 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 <laughs> so that is another emote so here you go have a look on the map just above the uh, Celestial Plaza, you can come here. Another place I found some is in Meadow Watch in the Highlands. This is kind of near New Asgard. Just here, you can find Sit. Uh, so you can make your followers sit. Uh, of course, you already would have Sit, so you don't need it for yourself, but it's uh, right over here, Meadow's Watch. And another one I found is usually where you would go to get a certain armor. But this time it has something different in it. So you come to this ghost guy, Forga, and he has a book for you now. He has Threaten, so you can now threaten people if you like. So this is in the Mounds of the Dead on this little island right here. 
And that's pretty much all the places I've found so far. Let me know if you find any as well that are unique or new or just work on your frills in general. A lot of them should. And uh, yeah, this is a really lovely update to see. Thank you for watching. I love you and I'll see you in the next one. Bye bye.